Well, hello YouTube. I'm trying out, and I've done it before, but not really officially, but I am trying out a GoPro Hero 3 Plus in a frame mount. And I usually use a Hero 5 GoPro and a GoPro four sessions which is a little cube but i'm trying this out because i got this off of a friend and uh pretty cheap and it was brand new it was a little too complicated for him to operate <laughs> Blowing like holy hell, Saturday at about noon. I did a little stuff up in the boat, as usual. You know, when your boat is, what, 25 feet from your front door, you can get a lot done. But I've noticed a lot of people on YouTube do a going over comments. Well, since I've got 11,800 subscribers, which is a total joke, I'd be doing so much better if even half of those people ever visited my YouTube videos. Good God, is the wind blowing. How many of y'all have a lazy boy in your garage? Yeah, this is my old lazy boy. I got a new one for Christmas, and it's got a cup holder right over here. This one's real pillowy. This one did me real well. I put many at hours sleep time in this Lazy Boy, but it's out here in the garage or the shop now. Sometimes I just like to sit out here, you know, ponder the, the, the boat, which is right here in front of me. This is sort of a wolf tail. I haven't done a wolf tail in a while. And a wolf tail is when I tell a story. I've done many of them. Not a lot, but many. I've done a significant amount of wolf tail story time, I guess you could call it. Uh, if you don't like that name, you can play more or walk. <laughs> Or walk uh, said, hey, why don't you just call it the Wolf Tales? You know, for Jetty Wolf, the name of my boat, if you don't know. But I've kept this on my phone right here. I'm not a texter with the public. If you want to do a charter, email me or call. You know, I don't sit around and text my doctor or I'm not texting the butcher at the grocery store. I'm not, I'm not texting businesses, but why people feel the need to text me. It's very hard to describe everything that I need to tell people in a text, you know, but they do that all the time because they're lazy. They don't want to call. They don't want to email. So, but here's one that I've saved ever since February 21st on a Friday, 2020. And he says, hi there, Captain Dave. What charters do you run at spring break? What charters do I run during spring break? Well, I decided let's chit chat with this dude. And I reply, same charters I run 365 days a year, inshore, light tackle, sport fishing, half day or full day. He comes back, okay, do you have a link to a website? I'll review. Well, where the hell did he even get me from? 99.999% on a listing where my website is located. Google, Bing, uh, a million other sites out there. 
you name it. He comes back, he says, okay, do you have a link to the website? Holy shit, I'll review, okay? And I said, of course, CaptainDaves.com. And he says, thanks. And then he says, what's the rate for a half day? Wife and I fishing. Well, I got a god dang rates page too, of course. And I said, when? Weekday or weekend? And of course he comes back. This is, the, you know, this is the reason I don't text, okay? With customers. He comes back, weekday, mid-March. Well, I'm getting a little, you know, this is going a little too long here. I could have wrote all of this in an email in about, you know, two seconds and he could have, he could have gotten all the information in one giant shot. Okay, I tell him, I deal better over email. 500 for a half day, four hours, 600 for a full day. He comes back, he says, got it. Okay, here's, the, here's where the good part starts, folks. Was looking for a gallery. You don't have any pics online? You mean now I have to have a gallery? <sighs> I got an entire blog that goes back three years. With tons of photographs I say yeah tons also have a complete YouTube channel with 700 videos and a blog top right hand corner icons my home page shows the big time three species in spring well there it is right on right on the front of my website there is pictures that go by Nice redfish, a great kid, Dylan, holding two beautiful pompano. So I tell him that, and then I say, I do accept phone calls, you know. Well, here's the deal. His reply was, I'm in the office working. It doesn't seem like it to me. Any dis, here's, here's the really good part, folks. This is the reason I saved this. Any discounts if I have the wife Bring along a tiny bikini. Make great pics for your site. Hmm. So now he wants to pawn off his wife. I said, oh, okay. 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm trying to just to let him know he could call me. And then I said, not really. The bill collectors don't care about your wife. It's a hassle to have pictures and all that stuff changed on a website constantly. That's the reason I have a daily blog. He comes back and goes, ha, 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 ha. I like the two bikini girls on your site. Well, number one, that's not my site. The two bikini girls were um, on a video. Of, and that's what people don't understand. It's a video of me doing a... I'm doing a video of them being videoed for another website. So he goes, ha ha ha, I like the two bikini girls on your site. Get this. Okay, here's the good part. The wife's boobs are bigger. I'll call you later. He never calls. I said, I don't know where they're at but they're not actually on my website. Meaning those two girls that went shark fishing with me. He goes, okay, cool. I love big tits. This is the text that I'm, this, this is going for minutes and minutes and minutes, folks. Okay, cool. I love big tits. And I write back, obviously. Here comes the good part, folks. This keeps getting better and better. You want to see pics of the wife? Now he wants to send me pictures of his wife. I said, not really. If you just called and gave me some dates, you might be better off. That's it. Never heard from him ever again. And let's see. This all started... Let's see. 
This all started at 3.30 p.m. and ran to 4.16. So this went on for 45 minutes. So he, in turn, wants to do a trip where he wants his wife to, I guess he wants to whore out his wife. Any discounts if I have the wife bring along a tiny bikini? Really? Yeah, I saved this just so I can someday do this video. I don't know who this guy is, never heard of him, but I saved this. I saved this. So that is the wolf tail. This is sometimes some of the crap that you have to put up with. Did I ever hear from this guy ever again? No. 45 minutes worth of texting where if he was interested in a, in a trip, I don't know where he found me, but I'm sure he could have clicked on my website, could have hit the contact Dave button, could have said, what do you have going on for spring break? And I could have said, okay, half day, a full day, this is the rate, give me a date, Blah, 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 $100 deposit, reserves your day. Um, I'll confirm after the reservation is made. Boom, bada, bang, as they say. And it would have been all done. <laughs> so there's a wolf tale for you. Most of my wolf tales are, in the past, kind of unbelievable things that happened. I don't keep texts hanging around on my phone but i thought i'd keep this one for you so there you go there's one more wolf tail man let's get through this winter let's get through this and let's do some fishing i'll see you on the next one